Hello, ever hello everyone. This is Donald. I'm back with another video, and in this video, I am going to be answering a quick question that I see a lot on the internet, and I can't believe that people try to do this, and they try to justify it, and that is they use multiple antivirus programs. So the main question is, can you use multiple antivirus programs? The answer is no. You're going to be saying, what? I can't? Um, no, the rule of thumb is you only ever need one antivirus program and one... You can have... If you're a general user, the general user will have one antivirus program, probably MSE, which I've already gone over, Doesn't isn't that well. Isn't that good. Um, the other part, the other thing is... You can you you can have one one antivirus, one firewall, and one form of an anti-spyware. What's an anti-spyware? Um, super anti-spyware has a built-in protection. Um, <coughs> what do you call it? Spybot search and destroy has that real protection, and uh, these two are good. Well, you're gonna be saying. I can only have one firewall. You can I can use the Windows firewall, right? Um, Windows firewall is good. Windows 8 firewall is really good. The technical, the best on the market by far is, um, what do you call it? Komodo. Type in Komodo firewall, and if you're on Windows 8, you'll have to download their entire suite for free. But uh, you'll just have to turn off the antivirus separately. Now you're gonna be saying, well. Why would I need a third-party firewall? Uh, let's just sh show things really quickly. A free, if you're using a paid-for suite, uh, like a total antivirus suite, like Bitdefender, Total Security, you will not need to worry about this. This does not apply to you. You will already have a built-in firewall with them, and theirs are actually really good, and they're very, they're known to be silent, and they're effective. If you're only going to use free programs, um, I recommend if you're going to be super security conscious, you can only you you should use. If you're only going to use free, use Avast because it has the most free shields. It's got the most protection for free. <coughs> use Spybot Search and Destroy. It has a built-in real-time protection. And for your firewall. A lot of people use Zone Alarm, Axe, but Komodo turns out to be better and has had less issues over the year. You can try Online Armor, but I've never used it, and a lot of people, not many people, have actually used it that much. But those are going to be your three main ones. Avast, um, Komodo Firewall, and when you get the Komodo Firewall, you have the Defense Plus in there. That is not an antivirus. That is actually a major component of the firewall that it will need and get a uh, spy bot search and destroy now the original question was well can i use more than one av program the answer is no and some people are not going to understand why it's because they're not compatible what do you mean they're not compatible if you have two antivirus programs that are defending you let's take for instance you have Bitdefender, Total Security, Avast, Internet Security, you have both of them running on your PC, you're going to be like, well, I'm I'm invincible. Well, yes, you, you, you should probably never have to worry about anything. However, if you run a scan, and there have been reports of this, uh, Avast in the past has recorded super anti-spyware as a virus, they've recorded Avast as a, as a, um, they've recorded them as a, uh, virus and they've had to go in and fix it well how do I put this to make it simple say one how an antivirus determines a product is how the where the products attach where the where the programs attach or the script and what is it doing if it's in their database and it's running awkwardly like it's trying to get into a security kernel like the heart of your PC, Avast is probably going to ring up the 
if it has internet security, it's going to probably ring up Bitdefender and say, uh, you, this program is being intrusive, and it's going, and it's a, it's probably some sort of like Trojan. Actually, yeah, it's going to be a Trojan, or it's just going to be a regular virus. And it's going to say, would you like us to delete it? Well, uh, if it moves it to the, if it moves it to quarantine or anything like that, well, Bitdefender is going to respond and say, whoa, 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 man, and it's going to be basically like. You can't do that, and they're going to be basically trying to be. They're just going to fight it out. Like the two programs are going to be. Bit Defender says you're being attacked by a virus. Avast says that Bit Defender is a virus, and they're both trying to fight each other and remove one another, which generally will lead to PC crashing and more issues, or just total like screw up of your operating system, and you'll have to do a refresh. So no, do not use more than one antivirus. You can use more. Than, you can use anti-spyware and antivirus. You can have multiple antivirus pro products. There is a difference. You can use multiple products. Make sure you only ever got the free version and turn off the real-time protection. If you want to surf the web, yes, you can have multiple like surfing browsers, like your little built-in extension for Chrome, like Avast Web Rep and. Bit Defender Traffic Light, I think that's what it's called. You can use those, but you cannot have two antivirus programs running on. You can't have two and two or more antivirus programs running with real-time protection. If the two feel that they're both viruses, you're going to screw up your computer, and not to mention the fact that you paid for those, so you're gonna you're really gonna be out of some cash right there. So no. Don't ever use more than one AV antivirus product. Other than that, uh, that's about it, really. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, like the video, subscribe, and share with your friends who are running more than one, and you feel like that they need to pay a little bit more attention about what it is they're doing. But, uh, thank you for watching, and goodbye.